part of the matrix if you're not growing, learning, and implementing. See, these three things allow you to see and understand what's actually going on around you. If you can't understand and peek through what is and what isn't, you'll forever be lost. That's the matrix. People that are just simply lost. They're not lost because they're on any particular journey or they want to know these truths or just know anything for that matter. These people just like to dwell, like things as it is. But the day that you start learning, growing, and always implementing everything that you learn, then you understand that life has so much more to offer. Life is a life is on a much more grander scale than anybody can ever realize. The problem is we tend to give up way too soon. We tend to put ourselves in bad positions. We do all of the things opposite that would put us in the position that we claim to truly want. We have to move with a purpose. And for your and for your sake, it has to be personal or it won't be permanent. We have to understand that the biggest enemy that we'll ever face will be ourselves the thing is is we don't know how to be our biggest fan and our biggest biggest critics we tend to only lean one way and it either gives us a a boasting ego or it gives us gravely depression neither is good if we we don't have balance we're out here seeking balance but Every day has to be a learning. I mean, it just has to be a learning process. Because the day that you stop learning is pretty much the day that you cease to exist. And we don't need that. The people need more originality than followers. It needs more leaders that understand that nations are built on dreams, hopes, but also work. And as individuals, we sometimes forget to put the work in. We only pray, wish, and just hope. And growth doesn't come on hope. Growth doesn't come on just prayer or wishing. It comes on it comes through with action but also consistency you have to be consistent in everything that you do in all that you do but you also have to give the effort that allows you to see the best results because what are you doing something for if you're not trying to get the I mean, the best, the ideal results that you are, that you are so-called catering to, that you so-called desire. I mean, we really have to get back to a real understanding that we are in control of our lives. So if we're down, it's our own fault. It's our fault. We can't put that on anybody else, even in love or business. We have to understand that trust has to be earned every day. Love has to be earned every day because all of these are jobs. 
regardless of how you look at it, you'll put your best foot forward or you will do enough to make the boss believe you're putting in your best effort. So why don't you do that in anything else? Especially in life. Because you need to have the hardship so that you can appreciate these things. Everything in life is worth it. It's worth it. But we have to truly understand what we want. And then act on it. Not just wish, pray, and hope. So listen, remember, if you really want your purpose to be fulfilled, you want to grow in life, then make the make everything personal so it'll be permanent. Y'all have a good day now. I love y'all.